What's up everybody? It's your boy Short Game Chef here with master wedge maker Aaron Dill, Pokey Wedges. Check it out. So Aaron has brought out three different wedges for us to try. We've created three different lies, a soft lie, a medium lie, and a firm lie. What we're going to do is sort of show you guys at home why it's so important to go and get fit and go figure out what bounce is correct for you and that you're playing conditions every day at your local course. So Aaron, talk to us. What yep. do we got here? So out here on the tour every week, we're working on bounce. You and I have had the chance to work together for years. Yep. Your short game is on point all the time. And the reason why is you and I work together to find what works best for you. Exactly. Uh, with that being said, we've got three great examples of situations where people might struggle. Mm -hmm. So you've got a real soft situation with a lot of sand, something in the middle, might be, you know, firmish softish. And then you've got something that's uh, on the firmer side where, you know, guys might struggle and say, hey, I, I bounced it into the ball. Yeah. Um, so I brought three examples. I've got a 14 degree, which is our F grind, a 56 10 S, and an M grind at eight degrees. Three different examples of bounces that somebody could choose to get them out of these situations. Okay, let me hit this 14 degree and we'll just go, we'll go through it here. So a little bit softer conditions. So right. the 14 is the most amount of bounce you guys offer? Well, we do have some other options, but as far as our retail Part, parts are, okay. 14 is the one, yeah. This is, our, this is our one right here. This is your baby. See how much sand you took up there? Real soft conditions, you need a little more bounce to save you from those conditions if you maybe just miss it slightly. So now if I, if I had the eight degree bounce out of there, is that digging in and, and, I, and it's coming through really, really heavy? Yeah, so you basically would dig in early, okay. the ball would come up a little softer, a little higher, and it would, come up, it would land short. Way short, okay. And you'd have to chip it again. Okay. So here's 10, this is gonna be in the middle. Oh yeah. You hear the difference too? Oh yeah. So when things start to firm up, Yep. You can hear it. It's got more of a click to it. Now, if I had too much bounce out of a little bit firmer, am I I'm bouncing into that ball? You'd bounce into the ball. The ball would come out low, and it'd probably go further than you think. Yep. Probably have a little spin on it, too, which would be good. Yep. But, again, it's trying to find that perfect bounce. Okay. Here's so an 8 degree. Is 8 degree. A little firmer? Correct. A little firmer conditions. Oh, wow. Again, three very different sounds and three very different divots. Yeah, absolutely. You've got a big divot here, medium divot here, and a nice shallow divot here. And again, if you had that wedge in your hand, the low bounce wedge and this, the divot would be really, really big. Okay. So it's all about reading the lie, understanding where you play golf, and then selecting bounces based on those conditions. This is epic stuff. If you guys want more info, follow my boy, Aaron Dill, Bokey Wedge Rep, uh, on Instagram, Twitter. This guy is a wealth of knowledge. He is Vokey's right hand man, and this dude makes some unbelievable wedges. Thanks for watching the video. Short Game Chef, AD, we're out.